My people, we now have a prince. So, as Oni of Ife welcomes his first son with his wife, Olori Shilekola. If you're joining us on this channel for the first time, we urge you to please click on the red subscribe button to subscribe to our YouTube channel and also click on the notification bell to get notified when we upload a new video. Yeah, we are saying congratulations to Oni of Ife Oba Adejej Ogunusi as he welcomed his first son and apparently heir to the royal throne with his wife Olori Shilekwola. The queen, who has been off public high since she became pregnant, has delivered a bouncing baby boy. The monarch took to Instagram to share the exciting news with his followers. He also noted that his wife and son are hale and hearty. The Oni of Ife had only one biological child who is in her 20s before the arrival of his son with his third wife. The king first, first two marriages did not produce any children. And sharing a photo of he and the queen, he wrote, To God be the glory, great things he has done. Hearty congratulations to the entire house of Odudua and Olori Shilekwala, who today birthed a prince to the royal throne of Odudua. Mother and child had doing well to the glory of God Almighty. The king's spokesman, Jera Moses Olafare, also shared the good news online. And he wrote, The heir to the throne of Odudua is born. This is to officially inform the general public that the almighty Oludumare has blessed the house of Odudua with a crown prince as her mother Yeyelua Olori Shilekunla Naomi Ogunusi gave birth to a bouncing baby boy at the early hours of this morning, Wednesday 18th, November 2020. Mother and child are in the perfect condition. So congratulations to the royal family, the kingdom of Ife, the source of Yoruba race and the entire descendants of Odudua worldwide on the safe arrival of this heir to the sacred throne of the Oni of Ife. Signed, Comrade Moses Olafare. Director Media and Public Affairs, Onis Palace. Here is the good news from the um, Ogunusi's family, and we join to say uh, congratulations to the family. And we all know that there was once a controversial about the Olori of Ife as they said for her to have lived the palace based on some rumors that were going on in the palace and they said um, because she couldn't have a child and probably because of one reason or the other. Even as that um, October 1st, um, there were still these controversies that they said the new of Ife or Badeya Yogunasi and his wife Queen Naomi Ogunusi are still expecting the birth of a new baby. And um, they said the director and the media of Moses Olafari told the newspaper that the story was untrue as they said the queen had delivered a baby boy and they debunked the news and by the palace. So um, people have already foreseen it that um, the queen is actually or pregnant when there was a rumor that she left the palace then so they said um, she left the palace because she couldn't post anything on social media so um, and she has been off social media for a long time so she actually came out to debunk the news by posting um, some um, pictures and like trying to correct the notions about to be the, the rumors that they've been spreading of 
So uh, now the serum so the the wife of Oni disappeared from the public Ife scene after I traced the speculation regarding a month marriage back, the Oni official also said that um, it would come to social media child um, after I wish the later rumors that Olori Naomi's marriage to Oba Adunusi had crashed. So the queen has come out to deny the rumor in his social media post and she wrote there have been strange rumors and unfounded news making round on social media in recent times. I want all believers of good news to know that it is all lies and a picture of how the peddlers of the evil news would have loved our love story to turn out. I would have loved to maintain silence. However, due to concerns being expressed by well-meaning people, something has to be said. Now, the gospel truth is that I have been busy with ministry of the social media space and you'd all agree with me that with the ongoing pandemic which suddenly sprung up on all of us only means more work needs to be done. I can't sit still as nobody privileged enough should and this isn't a time for social media presence but a time that calls for solemnity. Hence, my break from what people now call normal finally as duty will have me do i have been in and out of the palace doing god's biding with all being said i am compelled to ask the following questions why can't people verify that which is the truth why do people believe more in falsehood and negativity? Well, the Bible has something to say about them in Psalm 2 verse 1 to 12. It says, Now I say to you all, please regard and gestations every fake and malicious news about me and my husband Oni Adeyeje Babatunde Eniton Ogunusi for has is a love no earthly force is strong enough to break we are very fine and healthy I will leave you with this with this Please be comforted and know that boredom is a killer and people do imaginable things when they have peace and love always. So that is what the queen, Queen Naomi Adeye wrote on her Instagram or on social media to correct the notions of a marriage crash with the Oni of Ife Oba Okunuse. So once again, we are saying congratulations as they finally have a head to the throne and jubilations in the palace is ongoing. So guys, I want you to also um, comment at the comment section to wish the queen and the king a congratulation Please. on the Please arrival subscribe. of Please. their subscribe. prince. Subscribe, share this video. Subscribe to this channel. Tell your friends to subscribe to this ch channel. Subscribe to this